Hello everyone and welcome to the second episode here in our French campaign during the Pony War. As you can see we have another ridiculously poor planned mission here where we'll be flying up to Arnhem in the Netherlands for reasons beyond my comprehension. The weather is going to be poor on this mid-January morning here. And yeah, 300 kilometers to target. We're going to have like no fuel, but you know, everything's going to be okay. Without further ado, let's get onto the tarmac here. Now, I've heard there's some interest in showing the takeoffs for each mission, so I will be including those in these France videos from now on. But as always, I put in some uh, chapters to my videos if you don't want to watch the takeoff here. It's looking a little foggy today. This looks like, it also looks like we're going to have a good amount of French fighters in the air today. Looks like eight from our squadron at least. Allo, allo, attention les Ariac, prenez le 4, 3, 6, 0. Allo, allo, attention les gars, il y a du monde derrière et au-dessus, surveillez vos six. All right, let's take this bad boy off here. Hold on. What what do we have here? I was not expecting this. Looks like we have some enemy contacts right over the airfield here. Not exactly sure what's gonna happen with this here. Oh, it looks like they're engaging. Do our friends notice what's going on here? Let me tell my boys to attack them. We have the numbers advantage here. It looks like it's probably a recon light for the Germans here. But they still look like 109s or something like that. Somebody's freaking out. Alright, let's see what this other guy does. He went down. He's got a guy on him. Alright. Let's go like this. Allo, allo, contact à Milio. Enlevez la sécurité des canons. Almost snap stalled there. Avion suspect. A tes 7 heures. Ici, Rayak 8. Je l'ai pas loupé. Wait, 
Wait, what? The man just bailed out. I don't know if I inflicted that damage or not. Well, we'll find out. Ain't no way I got that lucky again. I literally just did a little spritz with two machine guns. That guy ain't feeling it, that's for sure. Take that. Little takeoff combat here. But now that that's over, I'll catch you guys at next contact. Alright, welcome back. We're at the recon point, and we got enemy contacts. Uh, there's a lot of them. Uh, where are my boys at? I need to know where my boys at. Uh, there's at least six fighters here. We might have a massive dogfight on our hands here. Alright, this guy's diving in on me. Woo! Okay, okay. Uh... Holy... Well... Damn. Oh, man. Classic mistake. Well, I feel like an idiot for that one. Well... I got a little too aggressive with the maneuvering. Yikes. Plane just couldn't handle it. I blacked out there for a moment and then well, I was going to end up pulling out of it, but the plane literally broke before I completed the pull-up. Jeez. Well, that was a short one. Unfortunate. Oh, shit. Yeah, I was hoping to see a little more action with the French here, but the rules are the rules. I die, that's it for that pilot. I was hoping if I was gonna die, I would at least be getting shot down. But, uh, no, I killed myself, essentially. Dang. 
That's very unfortunate. I'm just a little stunned at how that it happened so quickly there. It was like... I pull one evasive maneuver and then next thing I know I'm like blacking out while going like straight down and uh, yeah I had no idea how fast I was even going by the end there I wasn't looking at the HUD in the bottom left there let's say this guy's definitely in trouble Ultimately, uh, in historical engagements, these planes were kind of massacred by uh, the German aircraft. But it's definitely rough going, especially during the Battle of France. But yeah, this is probably going to be one of my uh, my shortest shortest runs there. Uh, I suppose I won't drag this on too much longer. Let's just see what happens to this guy here. Oh, and there he goes. Oh, he's dead, dead. Alright, well... I'll just let some time pass in the simulation here and see you guys at the final debrief for this French campaign. Alright, so we're at the debrief here. Definitely... I think it was just my flight of guys that got shot down. For some reason, uh, the first flight of Marines did not even engage the enemy. They just completely missed them. So it was like a 4v6, and combine that with the fact that planes were outclassed, clearly did not end up going very well. Admittedly, my death was my own doing. I pull, tried pulling a maneuver that I did not realize I could not do in this plane. And I paid the price for it with my life. Such is war, that happens. It's a bit unfortunate we didn't get to see the Battle of France end up playing out. But what can you do? Maybe maybe in a new season of this series I'll revisit this during the Battle of France, but But yeah. Sometimes the war does not go in your favor. And that is what happened today. At least we can say we got a kill on a 109 before he died. The very first mission. With that, I'll have to figure out what I'm going to do next here. Might just continue main mainlining the Soviet campaign with good old Maxi. Or I may put a vote up to see what we do next. Not sure what I'm going to do yet. But, as always, thanks for joining me. I'm looking forward to seeing you in the next one.